This is the first of two videos that were created to help orient you to the different parts of this course and its navigational structure. The course example being used for this video is the Mathematics Florida Standards Training Course for Grade 6. Everything you will be seeing will apply for any of the Mathematics Florida Training Courses being offered by our district. This particular video will cover the entry point of the course, which is the Please Start Here section. This section contains links to the documents you will need during the course, information about the online instructional resources you will be using, and the course syllabus. Let's take a closer look at the Please Start Here section. This welcome gives a brief overview of the course, and it is where you will obtain access to copies of all the course documents. The ones you may want to print are marked with asterisks in this list, and they include the grading rubric for posts to discussion forums, the lesson plan rubric, and the School District of Clay County's Framework for Intentional and Targeted Teaching. The next item in this section pertains to the different online instructional resources you will be using. You will need to make sure you have an established account and can log in to them before you start your coursework. CPOMS, Discovery Education, LearnZillion, PD360, and Teaching Channel will require you have a username and password to log in. This section will cover all the specifics on usernames and passwords for these particular sites. There is one other online resource you will be using and it is called YouTube for Teachers. Having an account for it is optional. If you find you need assistance with establishing your accounts or logging in, please contact your facilitator as soon as possible. The final item in this section is the course syllabus. You will obtain access to a copy of this, but here it is written out for you. The syllabus covers the purpose and the learning objectives for the course. There is a road map or pacing chart that shows when your various assignments are due. The last part of the syllabus is about grading. This is a pass-fail course. The total number of possible points is 200, and you will need to earn at least 80% or more of these points to pass. This table illustrates a breakdown of the assignments and the points they are worth. You will be graded on posts to course discussion forums using the rubric pointed out earlier. At the conclusion of the course, you will choose one Mathematics Florida Standards and will create a lesson plan for it. The lesson plan rubric pointed out earlier is the tool that will be used to evaluate your lesson plan. Don't worry, you will have an opportunity to submit your lesson plan to your facilitator for feedback before it is due for a grade. Then you may make any needed revisions and resubmit it to be evaluated with no penalty. This first video introduced you to the entry point of the course which is the Please Start Here section. Hopefully it has helped you get on your way to successfully completing this course. Please watch the second orientation video next.